Hey guys, what's going on today? We're gonna collect a bunch of cash from several of our vending machines, but first, we need to go inside Sam's Club and buy some product for those machines. So come on inside with us, let's go shopping. All right guys, first things first, we gotta get chips for our vending machines. These boxes have 30 bags in them. Let's check the price of these. 61 cents each. We sell these for $1.25, so right about double profit margins. All right guys, next up we have the 24 ounce Mountain Dew bottles. We sell these for $1.50 each. <laughs> $1.50 each, and as I was saying, let's see how much these cost. 85 cents each. Now, let's go get the rest of our stuff. All right, guys, let's see how much all this costs. Guys, well, that was fun. Let's get all this stuff loaded up in the car. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You know what? You do something. <laughs> All right, guys, we got everything loaded up in the car. Now it's time to go collect that money from our machines. Let's get on over there and get that money. Psych, you know we had to get pizza first. <laughs> Now guys, luckily this location has a cart that we can load all of our product into, but if you get to a location that doesn't have a cart like this or a dolly or something for you to carry your snacks and drinks in with, you'll want to bring something of your own because trust me, you don't want to be bringing in all of these snacks and drinks one at a time by hand. It's not fun. We've done it before. Trust me. Right. Bring some kind of dolly or have a cart or something. It helps a lot. Get this cart loaded up. We'll get in there and fill our machines. Okay, so I'm actually really bad at loading up the cart, so we're gonna have Cody, who's very good at piling in stuff and making it all fit, so. Ooh, they stopped putting them in the... They used to be like, the things that kill the turtles. Right, the <laughs> yeah, kill the, the turtles. plastic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Guys, as you can see, these no longer have the plastic rings around them. If you guys are familiar, normally when you buy Cokes like these in bulk, they have plastic rings that hold these together. As you can see, they've been removed. As Cody put, the turtle killers. Guess we'll just have to load them in just like this. Whatever works, right? All right, guys, as you can see, we have everything loaded up in the cart. We have half of it left for the other two machines, which we'll come back and grab after we fill our first two. So let's get inside and get these first two machines filled up. As you guys can see, these machines are very low on product. It's only been about 12 days. They don't normally sell this much. So let's go ahead and get these machines filled up real quick before we start losing out even more sales. Tip first. I have to find Typical. the right key. Though. And guys, know. another tip that we don't utilize is labeling your keys. That's As right. you can see, we don't even really have them actually labeled, so you guys should really consider doing that. <laughs> All right, guys, here we go. As you can see, here's the inside of the vending machine. 
per usual. We will start with the top row, which is our chips. Alright guys, Eli's a little rusty. He usually doesn't do full line right through. But usually, you want to start in the back so you can see what's in front of you. And it just makes it, it just makes it a little easier. We did like two things of chips That's last what, time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they, she said, yes, so just plain. Yeah, plain just, chips. Just, just two, just two of like the big boxes of chips. If you, just yeah, the chips. That's, yeah, that, well, as far as I know. Okay, right, great. Yeah, whatever. absolutely. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Is, well, so you need that here. But it's not going to be till November 5th. So okay, anytime, anytime before that. that. Yep. You got it. Awesome. We'll get Thank it here. Thank you so much. Thank yes, ma'am. Very cool. All right guys, as you can see, we have the machine nearly filled up, minus a couple selections, which we'll take care of shortly. But let's check out what you came here to see, the money from this machine. And per usual, we're gonna start with the change. Quite a bit of change in there, guys. Wanna help me open that, Cody? Thank you. Nice bit of change, guys. If you'll hold that for me, Cody, I will grab the dollar for the next. Now guys, are you ready for this? I want some guesses. How much do you think's in here? Are you ready? Guys. Look at that, guys. In just 12 days. This is why we love banking. Here comes the money. Money, 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 money. All right, guys, here's their money. We'll go ahead and get it put into the bag. On screen, you will see how much this is. We don't know yet, but we're gonna put it right here. Perfect. Let's move on to the next machine. Get this machine locked up real quick. Oh, almost forgot, guys. The red button to reset, to let to let the card reader program do wiki know that we have just restocked the machine. And always make sure your keys aren't locked inside the machine before you lock it. Now, let's move on to the soda machine. Guys, we are in the soda machine. As you can hear, it's a little loud. And look down here real quick, guys. As you can see, you see this fuzz starting to build up on this? This is where you take a little brush, and you, need, you can even use your hand very lightly, but you really shouldn't. You should use a brush of some kind, and you wanna get all of this fuzz off. It's making the machine work harder than it needs to, and we don't want that. So let's get that cleaned up real quick. All right, guys, we got this dusted off a little bit. We're gonna dust it a little bit more here in a second, but I also wanna show you on these soda machines, this pulls out and allows you to set your soda right here so you can easily just open these up and load in your soda. Let's go ahead and grab some soda and get going on that. So now we actually have a new flavor today of Gatorade, so you're gonna also get to see us change the display on the front of our machine. You can watch me do that now. All we have to do is pull open this back door here. And this piece right here just pops right off. And as you guys can see, here are our, all of our drinks displayed. We had a blue Gatorade that we were selling. Now we are selling Fruit Punch Gatorade. So we will just place that right there. Slide this back on. 
and get our new drinks loaded up. Easy enough. So, we're gonna grab our cash bag right here. Remember, here's how much we had from the snack machine. Remember? Awesome. Now, hold that for me, Cody. Thank you. Let's see how much money is in our soda machine, guys. And as you can see, no change, but there's a spill, actually. Looks like they didn't quite make it into the box, if you guys can see down there. That's okay, we'll fish those out in a minute. Let's check the cash. And nice, guys, a nice little stack in here as well. Love it. 12 days of profit right there. Let's add this to the bag. And that is getting nice and fat already, guys. Look at that. We'll go ahead and shovel in this change. And we'll see how much we have total here in just a moment. And into the bag. And just like that, guys, let's not forget our red button up here. We'll push the red button so it knows that it's stocked. We will close it up, move on to our next machines. Just visiting our little friends here at the nursing home before we move on to the next machines. That one's Fred, that one's Bob. And Jameson. Jam Jameson. Oh, and Peter up there in the corner. Hey, Peter. Peter, Peter could be, he can be a little rascal. He, he can be. Little rascal Peter. All right, guys, as you can see, we've got this machine nearly filled up as well. Here's how much we've got so far now. It's time to collect money from this snack machine. So Cody, if you'll hold this for me. Yes. First, we will check the coins. Very nice, just like the other snack machine. Just a bit of coins. Very nice, dropped another one per usual, no big deal. Put this back in here. And now, for the dollar bills. How about you guys guess? Any guesses, guys? See them down in the comments below, ready? Nice, guys, another big stack of cash. Very nice, and look at that, guys, some fibers in there as well. That's why we love this business, guys. Get that money in the bag. Bada boom. All right, guys, so as you can see, we are here inside the soda machine, and look at these guys. They are all just you see any soda, Cody? Because I don't. Oh, I think I see. Oh, never mind. I don't see it. Now. We'll go ahead and get this one filled up as well. Yeah. Start with our beloved Mountain Dew. Guys, we do have an issue. As you can see, this door does not like to stay open. So what we normally do is grab another container of heavy drinks, such as these Gatorades. Set them right there, and voila, you have a door stopper. <laughs> Hey guys, real quick, we wanted to point out that these soda machines can be real sharp on the inside. As you'll see here soon, when we're collecting money from this machine, Eli has a cut on his hand from loading sodas and we didn't even notice. Be careful of the unfinished metal inside of these machines. All right guys, we got this machine loaded up as much as we possibly could. This bag is already loaded full of cash. I don't know how we're gonna fit any more cash in here, but we're gonna try anyway. So if you'll hold that for me, buddy. 
first look at the coins for you. Well, not a lot of coins in there, guys. As you can see, a little more spillage, just like the last soda machine. Some with these soda machines, they like spilling their change, but no big deal. We'll go ahead and dump that in there. Minus one coin. Perfect. Now, the last dollar bill acceptor for this video, guys. The last one we've got. Any guesses, guys? Here we go. And not too shabby, guys. A little less than the snack machines, but obviously still very nice profits. There you go, guys. And let's see how that looks all put together. Wow, guys. That's what you call a fat pool. A fat pool. All right, guys, that's going to do it for this video. As you can see, we made a lot of money today from this location. Over $500. Here's how much total it was. Thank you guys so much for watching. Cody and I will see you real soon in the next video. Goodbye.